Welcome back to another episode of Real Ass Affirmations Podcast. I'm Chisa Penix Brown, your favorite mental wealth lifestylist. And today I have a great message for you. You can do anything that you set your mind to. Except for making everyone like you. Ooh, whose feelings are hurt already? I know, it's not even been a minute. Somebody's feelings is hurt. If your feelings are hurt right now, it's because you have this insatiable desire to be liked by everyone. But you have not found the power in being selective and in being selected. Ugh. Your feelings are still hurt? I bet they are. Let me tell you why. I know for a fact that I'm a likable motherfucker. Okay? Now, if you know you're a likable motherfucker, raise your hand. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Me too, right? But what I also know is as likable as we are, there will always be a motherfucker out there who doesn't like us. Now, why don't they like us? Is it because we cute? Is it because we put on our clothes? We keep our hair done? We smell good? Is it because we're smart? Is it because we're successful? Is it the car we drive? Is it our significant other? Is it our family? Is it where we live? Is it our zip code? Is it our cell phone carrier? Is it our business? Is it our kids? Is it our pets? It could be any of those things, but I'm going to tell you what it really is. You can do anything that you set your mind to, except for making everyone like you. And this is a problem for a person like you because you know that you're likable. But what I have come to learn is that sometimes People don't like you because of how other people like you. Oh, shit. <laughs> people don't like you because of how other people like you. Have you ever seen things and people are like, oh, yeah, well, I mean, she okay. He okay. But I mean, I don't see what the appeal is. I don't see what's so great. A lot of times it could also be people don't like you because they don't like themselves. They see something in you that they don't have. And because they don't have it and they can't acquire it because this is in your natural DNA to be who you are, they're jealous and so they don't like you. But I need you to also, on the flip side of that, know that it's not your job to make everybody like you. And there is power in being selective and selected. So for me, the people that love me, they love me, you know? They know that I'm a ride or die. They know that I'm going to do what's necessary. They know that I'm going to help. And even motherfuckers who we used to be cool, we used to be friends, we used to be associates, any of that kind of thing, they, they might not like me now, but they typically don't like me because of some shit that they did. And so because of how they did and I reacted to what they did, then therefore, oh, I don't like her because of such and such. But guess what? The motherfuckers liked me before they did something to me. And the same thing has probably happened to you. But it is not our job to make other motherfuckers like us. Our job is to be as great as we can be every day that we get up. And our greatness is sometimes too much for motherfuckers that are not doing enough. If all they have time to do is to be critical and to be haters, that's on them. That's not on us. So this is why it is your job and your responsibility to like you, to like the person that you see every day. Because you can do anything that you set your mind to except for making everyone like you. It's impossible. No matter how likable you are, there'll be somebody that thinks you're too much of something, not enough of that. 
no matter what. And you could be the nicest person in the world. They don't like how you stand. They don't like how you walk. They don't like something. They'll find something to not like, but it is not your responsibility to make them like you because they have convinced themselves that no matter what you do, they won't like you. But that's not your responsibility. So I want you to keep being as grand, as extra, as charming, as wonderful as I know that you are. Be that amazing light in the darkness. Be that candle that lights other candles. Be all that you can be. Except for somebody that everybody's going to like. Because you have a unique ability to make at least one person dislike you. (laughs) That's just it. At least one person. And sometimes they, they think they like you and then they realize that their shortcomings won't let them like you. And that's still not your problem. My job is not to be here to make everybody like me, but the people that do get the best of me, just like they get the best of you. And that's all that we can do in this life. Love ourselves and allow other people the opportunity to be a part of our life cycle. And if they don't want to be, get the fuck on. That's just it, right? So I want you to understand. I'm going to say it to you one more time. You can do anything that you set your mind to except for making everyone like you because it won't happen. Everyone will not like you but cherish those that do. Now, I hope you've enjoyed this message. And I want to tell you that you always need to show up and show out. Continue to give it to the people. And that's on Real Ass Affirmations. Hey there, it's Chisa Penix Brown. I am your favorite mental wealth lifestylist. And I'm also the host of the Real Ass Affirmations podcast. And I want to let you know, Podcasts cost money. Now, you might get them for free, which is a great thing, but I have to pay in order to make sure that you have all this great content. And I want to be able to keep doing that, but I would love to be able to get your support in order to make that continue to happen. So you can go to buymeacoffee.com forward slash RA affirmations and you can donate on a, you know, whenever you feel like it basis, or you can donate on a monthly basis and become a subscriber. So whichever thing floats your boat is going to be happy and make me happy and we'll all be happy together because I'm going to keep on giving you these great real ass affirmations and you'll be able to support with not only your listens but also with your dollars and I appreciate every dime so make sure you give it to the people literally so we can keep on giving you these real ass affirmations